Hi everyone, this is Mr. Bourne, the math teacher from Minnesota. This video is part two of how to do math with matrices. If you'd like to see part one, see what you missed, then click on the yellow rectangle. In this video, you will see how to enter and store a matrix, some advanced matrix operations, including RREF, the row reduced echelon form. That's an operation that will solve a system of equations. Let's start with this example. With this matrix, let's do three things. One, multiply it by a scalar value of three. Two, find the inverse, and three, find the determinant. We can do all three without needing to enter it three separate times. Instead of entering it directly on the screen, let's enter it using the matrix menu. Press second and the inverse key. There are 10 available memory slots to enter a matrix. Use the directional arrow key to move over to Edit, and then press Enter. Let's change those numbers to 3 and 3. And now we have a 3x3 three three matrix to enter numbers. Let's put in some numbers. Return to the home screen by pressing the second key and Mode key. Let's multiply that matrix by a scalar of 3. Press the second key then the inverse key to access the names of the matrices, and select matrix A. An A in brackets is inserted onto your home screen. If you press the Enter key, you'll see the actual values inside the matrix. Use the up arrow key on the keypad to go up and select matrix A again. Paste it onto the next line of your home screen by pressing Enter, and multiply it by a scalar value of 3. Want to see the inverse? Do this. I pasted the matrix name A, use the inverse key, and then use the convert to fraction function, which can be found by pressing the math key. Calculating the determinant is easy. Press second, inverse, and use the arrow key to see the options under the math menu. Determinant is the first one on the top. To insert that 3x3 three three matrix, just insert it from the matrix list, like so. Second, inverse key, and select A. It's inserted. Now press the Enter key, and the determinant is calculated. Now let's get to solving a system of equations. Here's the system of three equations we will use for an example. To do this, we're going to use what's called an augmented matrix and the RREF function. Begin by adding another row to matrix A by going into the matrix editor. Change it from a 3x3 three three to a 3x4. Another column is added and you enter the values from the system. Pressing second and mode exits the editor. Choose RREF and insert matrix A. Second, inverse, over to math, arrow key down the list to RREF. Select by pressing enter. Second, inverse, select A. Press enter to find the RREF matrix. Here's what this means. The fourth column are the solutions to x, y, and z. You need to make sure you have ones in this diagonal part of the matrix. This stands for the solution to x, this is the solution to y, and this is the solution to z. Thanks for watching. Please leave a comment. I like the feedback and check out some of my other videos.